Hello everyone, welcome to Chi Life Center. Thank you so much for watching this video, for being on my channel. Please subscribe if you're not subscribed already, helping us to get to 1000 subscribers. This way I can go live uh, in some of my classes and workshops just for a small portion of the time, okay? Um, because it would be a, a paying class or a workshop, mainly in the workshops. And for most importantly, the online lectures and any kind of online how-to that I feel is perfectly fine to share with you guys. So thank you so much for watching again. We're going to be doing uh, videos on summer, right? And what is good for you to do and practice in the summer. So this video is about sitali breathing, and this is a pranayama in yoga so that you can cool your body. It's a cooling breath uh, exercise. So there's different ways to do this by holding the breath and so on. I'm going to teach the beginner way first of doing this. Okay, so you want to be seated comfortably, hopefully uh, somewhere that's cooling for you and your spine is straight, shoulders relaxed, and you want to tuck the chin. The other important thing to know is that breathing is an exercise. It's an exercise for the lung. So if someone has not worked out yet at all, breathing will make you feel dizzy, actually taking a real breath, not just the motor breathing that you, you know, the response that you, you're doing every day without thinking about it. You want to actually take a deep breath, right? And, and learning how to breathe is an exercise and you can feel dizzy. So that's why I'm asking, requesting to be seated. So you do this with your tongue sticking out and it's done in that curl. Now, some people can't curl their tongue. So that is something I had to remember <laughs> before I started making this video. So do the best you can, like you're breathing in through a straw, right? So there's two ways of, there's many ways of doing this, but inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale through the nose, inhale through the mouth, exhale. And you want the duration to be the same. And it does feel cold on the tongue, so it does cool you down, but you could feel dizzy. So take a moment to just breathe normally and then repeat again. Breathe in through the tongue, through the mouth like a straw, and then exhale through the mouth. Another way of doing this is keeping the tongue like the straw and keep breathing that way. So keep doing that. Okay. So keep breathing like that. All right. And the other way of breathing is to inhale, hold the breath for one to two seconds and exhale. Inhale with the tongue like a straw. Hold the breath for one to two seconds, exhale. Now, if you don't work out at all, this, the third one I just showed is not recommended. The second one where you're continuously having your tongue like a straw or speed it up, right? You don't want to do that unless you have been exercising for a while and you know you're in shape. Otherwise, you just want to do the first one inhale and then exhale through the nose and do about five of those 
maybe three, and then breathe normally for five breaths, beginners, okay? Do this cooling breathing for three to five times. Inhale through the, the mouth, the tongue like a straw, and then exhale. Do that two to three times, and then, sorry, three to five times, <laughs> and then breathe five normal breaths. Don't even try to breathe five deep breaths because if you're a beginner and you're not used to actually yoga breathing, taking a deep breath, then um, definitely do not do that. Just breathe normally. That way you cannot feel lightheaded anymore and you feel comfortable practicing, practicing this. And this is just a way to cool the body down if it's overheated or in the summertime. Of course, you want to do other things um, as well. But if you're pretty much stuck in stuck somewhere, this is a great practice to do to also help in addition to cooling down the body. So thank you guys so much for watching. Please subscribe. I'll be putting up some more yoga videos. Um, this style, a lot of this sit down lecture, and also I'll be putting up uh, movement videos, um, some movement videos as well. Okay, so thank you guys so much, and I will see you next time.